All right, here everyone, welcome back to another Roblox Anime Fighter Simulator video. This video will probably not be too long, although there is some stuff I'm going to have to explain later about the game. But first, let's just get into the update in general. This is update 25. The new map, Time Travel Tokyo, costs 450Q. Obviously, this is based off of the anime Tokyo Revengers. You've probably heard of it. If you have it, then you're weird. But anyway, each star costs 21Q, and there is a new Robux star called Fr the Frosty Star in the Icy Waste. There are also new Limitless Fighters. I don't actually understand this, but it says there's a new Limit Breaker machine in Icy Waste. So let's just go check that out. Probably gonna cost like a billion yen, or like a, a billion different things to use it. Let's see. So you need to sacrifice two shinies and to break the limit on another shiny only mythical plus have the potential to become limitless okay wait can i pick my this oh i can oh for all fighters must be the same unit oh that, that's that's garbage bro okay but yeah. anyway on to the next part of the update there's a secret pity potion on the time trial shop. I don't know how much this costs, but I'm guessing it shows you secret pity for a certain amount of time. Also, there might be uh, new upgrades over here. Highly doubt it though. Anyway, let's go from here. Also, there is this uh, leak about a void unit over here because there's this new structure here and no one knows what it's for. But yeah, it's, it's probably fake, because it hasn't happened yet. But anyway, so if we go here, and it's all the way down here. Secret Pity Potion. So yeah, I don't know if it, it's like a certain amount of time or infinite, but yeah. Anyway, on to the next part. They overhauled the mount system. Buy Robux to increase the mount speed? What? Excuse me, what? So to increase your mount speed, you need to buy Robux mounts? That is that's stupid. All right, never mind. On to the next update. They added f four new player ranks and made ranks easier to get. I guess that makes sense, but let's see. Oh yeah, okay. That makes more sense. The new ones are Anime Legend, Final Form, Strong Hero Requiem, and I think this was originally the last one, but they moved it up. So, yeah. Anyway, on to the next update. There is a one time cap on all items in the game. So, yeah, just cap, blah, blah. And then they're just regular bug fixes. Although, I do want to say something. There has been some controversy or just some weird stuff going on that there is a glitch where some people's units or like all of their units just lose all their passives and many people are actually quitting the game for this so t to try to fix this the devs added a code called passive bug oh i guess it expired already but uh yeah so that happened anyway yeah, that's it for this video. Make sure to like and subscribe for more types of this content, and bye!